Hello and welcome back under the dome. Welcome back to Encase and playing hardball. We have done a good deed. We freed the poor people in the ca in this cage. Um, killed off the cannibals. That cage over there. This year, we killed off the cannibals. And now we can actually move out, and we are going to back to Junktown slums because there we can cash in this mission. And then we are actually well, may, maybe we even do some fighting. We are also rather tired, so let's just go here. We are camping, um, and I think we are going to do the fighting in the arena. Because we are, we are more powerful now. Let's eat something. Because we have mild hunger for three, so that's 431. Yeah, and I think it's time for fried hyena meat. That's, that's a good, that's some good stuff. There you go. And. And let's have a beer. Dark Secrets beer. We we'll love dark secrets, don't we? So, especially as we don't have any nasty food on us anymore. Let's rest. 1400. Let's sleep for 10 hours. Like that. Eh, yeah, that was a bit more, was it? But well, whatever. <coughs> so. And then we move out, camouflage and night shift. And the good thing is now it's four in the morning. Yeah, I'm actually not sure if we are quickly enough. There, to, oh yeah, there something is happening. The forest is unexpectedly humid, and the trees closely spaced for conditions under the dome. An indistinct noise leads us to a large clearing, not too far off. We glimpse some figures and the gaps between the trees watching us. Let's look through our binoculars. What do we see? Large insects, cockroaches. Yeah. Let's hunt them because cockroaches means food. Right? Even though it's maybe not the nicest food, but oh yeah, there are anomalies here. What what's this? We're in the middle. Oh, it's a nasty roach queen. Another and spitter up there. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, so let's get out of our servo shell. Uh, what's this? Mild thirst, perception brains and deafness. Where did the thirst come from? 401. Hmm. That is less than ideal. Um, and I don't want to drink any alcohol right now. We could drink a coffee. Do we don't have any other beer? Well, and I don't actually, I don't want to use the packaged water. Because that is rather precious, but maybe we should actually. Don't we have a soda? Ah, oh, yeah, here's the soda. Show soda. Healing thirst. Yeah. Fired up. Um. 60, 90, yeah, well, and then let's let's drink a soda. Bam. That is refreshing. Crump and Fox, you guys just stay here. And then we are sneaking forward. So that's just a regular worker roach. Let's sneak around here. Oh, it's a nasty beast. Good. Oh, that's that. Oh, 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 no, 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 don't find us. Oh, that was a very close one. That was a very, very close one. Well, and that happened. That's what happens if your enemy has the high ground. Go like here. Can we shoot it from here? Yes, we can. Nice. Going over there. Ah, yeah, very good. It got a laceration there. Very good. Nasty, ugly roach.
But that works out pretty well uh, so far. Let's wait for it. There. Missed. Come on. How could we miss it? And again missed. What is happening? We have 100% hit chance. And I think it's more the dodge thing, so or maybe maybe the uh, the shot ricocheted off the armor or something. There, sneaking away. Oh 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 oh! Oh my goodness! Why why is everything so so close today? One more laceration. There, so now we can kill it off. Come on. Come on, it was 90%. There, I think we are, we, we have it now. They are good. Done, very good. One roach is down. And especially the nasty acid roach, only one cockroach egg. Which is sad. I had hoped for some more food for us, but well. And as we know, the cockroach legs, they are just like eating a lobster. Yeah, very good. It has a laceration as well. This one is not as dangerous as the others. Fortunately. I really like the sound. It's like really kind of a disgusting sound. There, I have another one. They are good. It's great to be a criminal, isn't it? To be able to sneak like this. That's good. Oh, no, I... Oh, I overplayed the cards. Okay, crap. Sorry. Sorry about that. We want to stay hidden, though. Okay, well. Going here. Shooting it. There, very good. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, well, yeah. I got too cocky there. Before. Moving in too quickly. And I think I didn't even wait for the laceration. So it could nicely bleed out enough. Ah. Okay, and again. Yeah, okay, sorry. Okay, now it's like the, the problem is that it has such a high um, radius. With its attention, but I think it's possibly also happening because it has the high ground here, I guess. Let's shoot from here. Yeah, yeah, shooting from the red is a very bad idea. Missed. Hmm. Oops, what happened? I didn't click anywhere. There, yeah, but now it should bleed out. Yeah, very good. It's gone. Dead. Very nice. Second cockroach is gone. Uh, yeah, and well, by the way, so with this strategy, you can basically uh, play the game without companions and then even get this other good perk. Like the lone wolf thing. Very good. Very good. Ah, but it didn't get a laceration.
It's 87, 84. Oh, 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 oh. Still no laceration there. That's a tougher acid roach. No, it's a flying roach, by the way. Not an acid one. I think we need to use some psychedelics. Oh, the mother roach is coming. Very nice. Laceration. Oh, by the way, what's that? Sluggish. Ah, oh, yeah. Ah, it's, but I think it's always sluggish, huh? Well, that's not so bad. That is not so bad at all. Hissing sound. Shooting. Very good. Got another laceration. Very nice. Very nice indeed. So the cockroaches are upset now. Let's have one of this. Very nice indeed. Do we finally have the laceration on it? Oh, that's the mama roach. Oh, reload. Come on, come on, come on. I want to shoot. Oh, it's too late. I think the, the dart would have flown away. So let's finish off with Mother Roach. Very nice. 266 experience points. Smelly, dirty roach over there. Uh, and it has the pheromone cloud, by the way. The new transmitter suspension in the air makes cockroaches more effective in combat. Ah, and that one is also nearly done. So very nice. Very nice indeed. So the mother roach is actually the first one we should uh, kill. Yeah, here. So very nice. One roach eye. And then here, this one. What do you have? Some legs. Okay, well, legs we can suck out, right? Sucking out the cockroach. Meat and juice. Oh, there's another one. Yeah. Now that's another flying roach. It is behind the anomaly. We might even... We might even... Uh, trick it into the anomaly, huh? Well, here. Crump and Fox, you guys. Rather fall back a bit. And then... Let's shoot it there. Nice. Good. It got a laceration there. Getting out of here. Very nice indeed. No. Okay, well. I do have admit. I mean, do tell what you think, guys, in the comment section, please. I like it to do this uh, thing here in stealth and so on. But of course, it's less spectacular. Yeah. It is certainly less spectacular. Although really efficient. And it also reduces uh, our risk significantly. So, like really significantly. We actually go like so, yes, we can. It should actually smell all its uh, all the other corpses there. Very nice, a crit. It chirps. Ah, oh, yeah, very good. It's it's. Nearly dead now. Very good. And dead. Very nice indeed. Come on, Crump and Fox. Come over here. Okay, take him all. And then we can actually... Suck out the cockroach juice. All together, everybody gets one leg, huh? 
<laughs> like a straw. Everyone has one straw inside of the cockroach body. There. So, alright. I think that's it. And there's, uh, there's po probably also no chest or anything here, right? I didn't see anything. But it's fine. So, there. Very good. Oh no, there's one ammunition box here. Very nice. Oh yeah, nice. Yeah. So, I mean, we are really doing the, the super smart uh, approach. Um... In using the stealth and uh, the wasp but I do agree if someone oh there's another container there I do agree if someone say, would say like well it is it is it is not the most spectacular that we could go and that's true which is why we are probably not doing this one here the whole time but it's like really good for boosting us Stopping Sneak Getting back into our servo shell and then we are out of here good Well, at least we got some ammo Let's have a look. We do have level 17 and need Yeah, seven a good 7,000 experience points. That's actually not super far away Yeah and I want to have the signs next, or maybe the medicine. Yeah, I think the, we, are, we are taking the medicine next. But let's see. So, traveling, leaving. And now it's time to go to Junktown slums. We are even, we are even doing pretty well. Um... It's, we need to go to the slums because that's where the sheriff is and then we can tell him that uh, we helped the... Town will be packed tight. is that so buddy oh hi there Yuki how are you doing speak quickly anything new no oh yeah well don't want to scare Hello you again. Uh, well Okay, you don't have anything else. Nothing new for you. Then Come have a nice again. day. Keep up the good work. So the ch the sheriff here is here he is Kurt Spengler. Quick saving. Hello, Kurt. Uh, good news. Oh, do you want something? Yeah, we visited the cave you told us about. There was a gang of cannibals. And, well, we killed them all. Spengler sticks out his lower lip. Ah, oh, society is a gift that keeps on giving. Whatever shit is going down, people always find a way to rain down some more. So you killed the bastards, eh? Good. Hopefully that will put an end to the disappearances. Later. Eh... Uh, didn't we what ah we got plus 15 reputation with blackwing nice and plus five reputation with fox very nice good rep with fox yeah well oh yeah that's ah okay so i guess that's an extra bonus if we uh finish missions hmm if only crump hadn't gone down then things would be even better back then, you know, here. Crumb's confidence in us has been shattered since he nearly died under our command. Yeah, that shouldn't have happened. But well. Fighting is dangerous. So, and well, now that we are so fresh with the fatigue, everything is fine, I think. Let's actually go down here. Fox and Crump, they like the fighting, so I guess it would be a good idea to fight. Well, I mean, it's 7.41 in the morning. I'm not sure if there's any fighting going on, but let's see. Uh, 
Ah. Is there? Is there actually? Patsy? Good day. The bookmaker springs up. You've come. I see you have. You shouldn't have come so early though. Business hours are from 6 p.m. until morning. Yeah, well, we, we hope that it was actually morning. Oh, you do have a lot of stuff there though. Yeah, well, then... Then we will just vanish. And... I guess we are actually... Yeah, we are taking on... Um, Katarzyna. Yeah. Come on in. And then we make way to this other bunker. Magellan Station. Um, and that's the beauty of it. It's it's rather here laboratory and medical air sta medical aid station. That's the beauty of it. It's rather con uh, uh, convenient to get Floor there. Level minus four. So, by the way, and so, Crump, my dear. Um, yeah, I mean the worker's belt. So that's like a good item. And we only have this one here, yeah. Give the worker's belt and this backpack. And otherwise, yeah, you can keep that stuff. Engineer's cap, though. That we want. And we need this relic here as well. So, and everything else you can keep. Also the Reaper. I think it's fine. I don't, I don't want to uh, switch around so much stuff all the time. And I think it's fine. You can run like this. Okay then, Crump, my friend. The bruiser quizzically sticks out his chin. Mm -hmm. How about you hang around the bar a bit? All right then. If you need me, you know where to find me. I do. See you later, buddy. So there. And, and by the way, we had the reputation with Blackwing, right? Where are we standing now? 45, yeah. That's good. The Blacks are grateful for helping Kepler and Holiday complete their mission on Nashville. The proof of our... Yeah, I think Blacks are grateful for your actions. So that was for the cannibals. Yeah, I think it's fine. So all this means... Please stand by for decontamination to end. Let's pick up Katarzyna and then we can actually do a little bit more cooking. Hey Kata, how are you doing? As you approach, Katarzyna dives for cover behind the glass table with test tubes on it, hiding her face in the usual manner. She looks from behind the table carefully. It's you again. I mean, I wanted to say I'm glad to see you. Despite the fact that I had to leave your team. Yeah. Don't get worked up on that one. Let's travel together again. In her eyes. You're saving me all over again. That's good. So come on. Come along. Lady. Please stand by for decontamination to end. And then we actually go here. Use the wash basin. Yeah. Are we looking good? Yes. Using the bathroom. No one is watching, of course. Oh, yeah, guys. So, and then washing the hands. Again, very good. And then I think we are actually going... Yeah, we are going to the residential uh, level. We might even take a little power nap now that we are here. 
residential area. And then we could just sleep in our nice bed for an hour or so. Level minus five. And so let's go over here. Do we actually have any food left that we could cook? Let's see if we have that. So we have the better bed. So any food? Yes, we do. Oh no, the cockroach eyes. Yeah. Well, we do have... We do have the eggs, so let's take all of them. Yeah, so I oh know they are fried. Okay, we have fried cockroach eggs, so let's have these ones. Red feet, boiled volpa, fried volpa, fried volpa gland, red toes, that's all okay. And then red tail. I mean, I, I wanted to keep some of them, right? like to uh, in case someone wants them but I, I guess we can actually cook everything or prepare everything as meal um and if anybody by uh, by any chance would want some stuff then we can just uh, hunt some more and by the way i feel that we are actually getting a lot of that stuff anyway so let's go congratulations here congratulations to you all happy holiday to you Happy holiday to all of us. Oh, is it a happy holiday? Thank you. Oh, by the way, we do have some tools, components, and supplies. We have 34 empty air gun. Oh, yeah, here, let's fill them up here. Air gun power, let's craft maximum. Bam. 33 experience, yeah. Could have gone into sneak mode, of course. But I didn't feel that was necessary. However, now we go into sneaking and crafting fried wolper tail, crafting the maximum nine experience points, fried hyena meat, craft one. Katarzyna, are you watching? Do you like it? Fried red tail, craft the one. Fried roach legs, craft maximum. Red roast. Well, we do have the salt and the onions. Okay, boiled eggs, fried cockroach eggs. Let's do all of those. Okay, and well, then let's do the red roast then. How many is some? One, two, three, four, five, four, well, let's say six. And we've got seven salt and one onion left. And I guess that's fine. Yeah, nice. And Katarzyna is impressed with our cooking skills. Another five reputation there. So, and what do we have? Katarzyna, dear. We have 60 with you now. Katarzyna likes you. Likes that you know how to cook deliciously. Very nice indeed. Quick saving. Come on, Katarzyna. Are you saying something new? I'm starting. The wife nods cautiously. Okay, just don't ask me about what happened at Magellan, okay? You won't, right? Yeah, don't be so dodgy. So, well, I I have a few personal, personal questions. questions. Ask away, but I'm not promising anything. The white yeah, I mean, we know each other for so long now. Don't go pale there, dear. So, what can you tell us about yourself? About myself? I never talk much about myself, <laughs> even on dates. Uh, I have an honors degree. I've never been married. Never had any abortions. Well, it's good that you didn't have any abortions. Yeah. I guess you are very much pro-life then. <laughs> what, is, what does she want to tell us? But do you have any kids, dear? My parents no? have well. a nice home in Wisconsin with a swimming pool. They got two cars. Dad thought about buying a yacht, but uh, I'm probably telling the wrong things, right? Huh? I'm just spewing nonsense. Bellitzka yes, you are. Silent in frustration. The white okay, is anything else? Okay, just don't Let's talk about something else. Yes, yes, fine, ask away. 
I hope you're not okay, well, away. then no. then we don't have anything. But it, it's it's okay, Katarzyna. Don't work yourself up about anything. So here, let's get into the servo shell. Actually, Katarzyna could Four, make herself useful two, and polish uh, and check out our servo shell while we have our power nap. How about that? That's Alice Foreman. So, Alice, anything new? Why do you keep bothering me? Oh, uh, well, later. charming as ever. And you there? Welcome back. She Enfield greets us with a strained smile. Oh well, we are not on a first name basis then. Despite your greed, you did an excellent job. Thank you. Well, bye bye. You're welcome. So, well then, so let's go into our room. Homely comfort. Very nice indeed. So, well, let's go put the stuff here into the personal box. Um. Well, I mean, <coughs> we can we can make a grand party here. The fried red tail, fried roach legs, red roast. Let's have one of them with us. Cockroach eyes. Uh, by the way, what's happening? Why are we not hungry anymore? Oh, we are hungry. Okay, 333. That's good. Okay, because I want to eat this crappy food. Um, oh, let's eat the crappy food first. So, we have the red foot, for example. Consume red foot. Nasty food. Minus two brains. Yeah. 283. Let's hope that we don't have a red foot between our teeth there. Fried roach legs. Fried red tail. That's just hunger minus 40. Smelly food. So the fried cockroach eggs and then 68 so let's have another red foot there oh that's it's it's really disgusting so there oh what what was that did we get something nausea okay yeah, that's fine so then food <clears throat> put all that stuff away we keep the hyena meat. Fried roach legs can also go away. The mouse. And I feel we just we should just keep. Uh, let's maybe let's put eight away. Let's put three beers away. So we have three of all kind. And I yeah. I mean, we can keep this other stuff, canned beans, just in case someone needs them. So, that's that. Maybe even, even like this. So then what did we loot that we could actually put away i know i am a total pack rat um, ain't i the modern the assault rifle yeah i think that one can go in here we have one on level four anyway mm, and then yeah but i think it's actually we are fine oh and by the way What's this? The Peltas Gloves. Heavy weapons plus five. Contraptions melee weapons. Um, Katarzyna. Let's, by the way, let's give her some stuff. 
first. Oh yeah, the, she doesn't have anything, that's the point, yeah. Um, there. Worker's belt. Oh, I should have, I before cooking, uh, okay, I forgot, but it doesn't matter. Before cooking, I should have given her some stuff, but yeah, that's really like micromanagement, the extreme. Uh, she can wear these shoes. She can have the, the albatross. And she can actually keep that one. Oh, and we can actually uh, use this this jolly driller here, and then we get the charisma. Let's do that. Charisma plus two for thirty six hours. Let's do that, like so. Can even put this one here because by sleeping we get some stuff. Hand to hand. Yeah, that's high tech plus ten. Right, yeah, so she can definitely keep this here, like forever, unless we find something better. And then the backpack, and some pants. Katarzyna, how about you take on some pants, you put on some pants. There. And... Well, we kind of don't have anything here for the base slot. And this here with the learnability, so the engineer's cap is actually a better choice. So I guess it's fine like this. I guess it's fine. So can we actually upgrade this weapon here? I take modification 70 of 80. We can't. And that is the reason why I want... So high tech, what was that again? That was science, right? Yeah, here. Yeah, so we, we are going to have science next. That's the thing. I also want to see what happens with the scanning and so on. Maybe that even would that would even improve uh, Yuko stuff. So. Yeah, definitely. And then we are actually doing pretty well. Then after science medicine and then we are everywhere on the third level, on the third row. And then we can actually go into a bit more high-tech weapons. And by the way, we only need five points more. Yeah, but I wanted the 30. Yeah, yeah okay. So, well, then search Yeah. Actually, I think we can put the Demicrotus helmet there. The volunteer worker boots. I don't like the evasion, the reduction of evasion there. That's really bad. Signs. Yeah, we keep that one just in case we need it for something. Ah, signs is 10. So this is actually worse, right? Ah, yeah, then these can go as well. Um, and the relic caddy. Can also go away because we already have uh, several of those, and it doesn't look like it's actually better evasion. Yeah, that doesn't make a difference. It's always better to have the pin in there um, for more learnability. In my opinion, thinking long term, the imp. Yeah. That would be a thing like if there was a situation where we need to dodge something or so, like so we need deftness to make a skill check or so. But we can actually keep it in our inventory, I guess. Yeah. And well, now that we don't let anybody die, we are also not taking the Mobius strip with us. But if we were really evil, like a truly evil psychopath, and you possibly know, if you know my other Let's Plays, uh, the discussion in uh, Atom RPG, if our hero is actually a psychopath. So psychopath was, would certainly use the Mobius strip and kill off their friends or like their companions just to get a little bit of Psyche more. But yeah, that's not us. 
So, and then this here, the handyman's jacket. That's for the criminal, in case we need that. Yeah, okay, so I guess we are set. Then the ammo. We collected more ammo. Which is actually pretty nice. Assault rifle, we don't need that. That is fine. Rifle, handguns, your weapon power cells. Like, I mean, 80 is enough, right? There. And like with this here, can also reduce to 50 again. I guess that's fine. The air gun power, let's go. That's all that we have, right? Tools all are, uh, are all fine. Or are they? Yes, they are, I guess. Well, we could lose some of this crap. And Nesetam. Let's just have five. So, and I guess we are actually set. Yeah, it's fine. You see the red force. Yeah, just in case. Or like maybe let's let's only have five of them. And that is for criminal. And the shark is like the real melee weapon. Yeah, actually, we don't really need to have this one around the shark because we have the galenas and this one is the galenas should be the yeah it's a scalpel yeah that's the thing so we can actually leave the shark behind because fox uses her knife anyway and we have upgraded it already okay it's fine that's pretty fine and by the way katajina um, you have a second weapon can we actually compare where's the, the, the other cryo laser here? So this one, ah yeah, the Boreas is actually better now that we haven't upgraded the Katarzyna's weapon. So how about we give her this one here and then she can actually... That looks actually pretty cool, having the two pistols here. I think that's fine. So and she has the high-tech weapons, but the, she can only use the high-tech weapons, yeah. I did like the idea of her using uh, the Pulsar as well, though. Because it has the, the area effect. That's actually pretty cool. But I think it's probably not necessary. So, at this point. But once we have upgraded this one here, then she takes the Pulsar again. And by the way, the Pulsar... Ah, we can, we can up, can we, why can't we upgrade it? It's four, two, ah, one electrical equipment. Oh, we can do it. Or we could. Okay, that's good to know. But we are not doing it right now. And this one. We could also upgrade the Boreas. Improved version of the Cryolizer. Yeah, we already checked that one out. Yeah, that's actually nice. Also has a longer range, which is which is making things way better. But I feel it's actually also kind of a waste a bit. Because we are not using that at the moment, at least. Although, yeah, well, actually high-tech weapons is our best one now. But it's more like because of the wasp. Yeah. No, it's fine. I think we are fine. I think we are doing pretty well. So. Saving. And now. We are going to bed for one hour. 11. There. Sleeping off. And. Well, we do have a very, very nasty taste in our mouth now. Also, we didn't brush our teeth even. Oh yeah, but we are doing really well now. Very nice. Very nice indeed. So, very nice indeed. Um, and I think, yeah, we don't need to... Uh, we didn't collect anything anyway. We didn't get much loot actually. Lately, just some stuff. So... 
So, let's get out of here. Now it's 11 in the morning. So, it's fine. We are on our way now. Okay. The hall. Karajina, lead the way. You are the lady. Floor level. Minus one. Which doesn't mean that Fox isn't a lady, but well. Well, no idea of the Servo Shell has forefather parts. Well, or, or rather, we do have an idea, right? But we are not uh, telling. So let's go here. Very nice day. Yeah, and I think actually it would be nice to have a vehicle. Maybe we should try and get one. We actually decided a couple of times not to take one because uh, it would have been, well, theft and stuff. But maybe we actually we should have uh, driven around and just left it somewhere. So here we are. And now we are going to the Kaleidoscope project. There we go. Because, let me just check some, some things. So here, data. This is Mag Magellan. Kaleidoscope Campbell Bunker and Sonora Bunker. The Sonora. Why didn't we take... What? We were here already. Huh? Ah, oh, no. Oh, no. Sorry. It is... It, it adds a, a, a different... A second line here. So it's just the kaleidoscope and the Gretel bunker. Yeah, that's the one. But Gretel is like somewhere... I oh, know. It's here. Over there. Okay. Yeah. That was the longer way. That we do another time. Oh, there. We notice a squat, motionless bulk, not far off our current path. Then we discern several people standing beside the cards. A typical group for a small trading post, a merchant and a couple of guards. Judging by the gunny sacks piled on the better transport, this is the Carmen Heights food store. Oh, yeah. Looking a bit closer, the magnified picture confirms our guest. Three men looks like a father and his two sons are transferring food supplies from the boot to the counter. They haven't spotted us yet, but they are plainly expecting customers. All right, let's approach them. Ah, yeah, they have uh, also... Or she has some interesting gear. So hello, Mike Smith. Well, hello, or he. Dear. The youngster looks attentive at us with fathomless blue eyes. I don't trade. Daddy does. Well, do you have anything in your pockets? No? Okay, well then. Our interest in you is rather limited. Milton. Hello. Nice to meet you. A middle-aged man with a gray beard runs his eye over us. Hello. Wanna trade? Well, you know... Let's introduce ourselves and ask who they are and where they are from. We're Smith & Sons Company from the Republic, you know, Carmen Heights. We sell potatoes and onions for provisions. We raise the crops ourselves, trying to catch, scratch up some coin for a truck, because driving this bone shaker is a pain in the you-know-what. Well then, let's trade. What do you have? Oh, what's that? Oh, a potato pie. Oh, we have new stuff. Atlas lettuce, a genetically modified plant containing a huge amount of vitamins and minerals. On its mighty leaves rests a fair share of the Kamin Heights economy. Ah, oh. Proper nutrition ready meal. And then here the potato pie. Hunger minus 200. Very hearty food. Farmer's pie hails from Kamin Heights. Tastes like democracy. Oh, wonderful. Wonderful. But you know, we are actually not hungry at all. We are doing very well. But we could actually get, uh, use some salt. Let's get some salt. Um, oh, we have a lot of money here. Why do we have so many stacks of money? Oh, like that. So there. Accept. Thank you very much. And then we go. And then 
Hello there, Max. I'm all ears. We see young, round face and provincial looking fellow. I talk business with father I just got. Yeah, well. What do you have in your pockets? Nothing. Okay, then let's go and goodbye. Little snake here. Let's not step on it. Going there. Come on, guys. Katarzyna, how are you doing? You've not been on the road for a while. Ooh, let me just catch some air. You know, I just need to go peeing around the corner, guys or gals. Just wait here, have a look on the servo shell, and let's sneak around. Just like that. Let's look into their supply barrel. Yeah, they are doing their stuff. They are not seeing us. Moving around. Actually, I would feel that it would also be cool if we had some form of caravan like this. Or oh, does it have a flat tire? No, it doesn't. No, it's fine. A caravan that we can actually um, sleep in. That would be that would be kind of nice. So let's have a look there. This, this very tasty potato pie. Well, let's have let's have Atlas ledges. Let's have like maybe three of them. Five water. This is balanced ready meal, healing hunger, hearty food. Let's have one of those, this one here, and well, then. Let's do like this, and then they have some cash left to change. There you go. Yeah, I'm sorry. We are thugs and crooks, I know. That's really not good, but that's just, you know, the the ethical challenge that we are that we are on, of course. It's not good to steal. That's actually like someone who steals a lot, so doesn't respect other people's property and belongings. So that's actually like uh, indeed a significant factor that speaks for being a psychopath so that's for sure so here come on guys let's get out of here i just needed to wash my hands then we've got the kaleidoscope project there entering location so and now that we are here yeah we checked everything here the bunker entrance so we wanted to actually go in there right oh, yeah let's go around here because there was some form of radiation there hamster that guy the rusty air duct radiation plus one come on guys get out of that zone so and my dear fellow guys and gals under the dome what happens next behind this rusty air duct in the kaleidoscope bunker that we had cleared out before over here kaleidoscope project we will see you in the next episode thanks for watching hope you enjoyed this one well we did some cockroach hunting and we have katarzyna on the team again we did some cooking she likes us better still very insecure about herself but yeah i th also think like we gave her some stuff and i think she is going to keep it no matter what. And oh, by the way, what am I doing here? We have this one, right? I forgot about it. Here, there. Katarzyna, you get this pin back. And we get this pin. There. And by the way, yeah, let's check this one. Yeah, we have the Jolly Driller Relic. The Jolly Riller. A Driller. So, yeah, do tell what you think. <laughs> what is your take on this artifact? What does it stand for? What did it do, actually, while we slept? That is the big question. Yeah.
what happens next we will see in the next episode i hope you liked this episode just a teeny tiny little bit and if so please do click the like button and subscribe to the channel if you've done so yet so never ever miss an episode again see you next time bye bye